Recently, Aptera made significant strides in the United Arab Emirates (UAE), a move that has the potential to shape the future of EVs in the region. This video delves into Aptera's journey in the UAE, highlighting the steps taken by Chris Anthony and Steve Fambro, the company's co-founders, and the reception of their vehicle in this strategically important market. Before we get into this, if you're enjoying our briefings on Aptera, please consider liking and subscribing to this channel and turn on the bell notification to be notified of any recent video. Thank you. Aptera has captured the attention of the automotive world with its unique approach to EVs. Unlike traditional electric cars, Aptera's vehicles are designed to harness solar power, significantly reducing the dependence on external charging infrastructure. The vehicle's aerodynamic design, low drag coefficient, and lightweight construction contribute to its impressive energy efficiency. For those commuting short distances, Aptera offers the possibility of never needing to charge the vehicle using conventional methods, thanks to its solar panels that can generate enough power for daily commutes. Recognizing the potential of their technology, Chris Anthony and Steve Fambro took proactive steps by visiting the UAE to present Aptera to key stakeholders. Their visit was not a spontaneous decision, but the result of over a year of planning and coordination with strategic partners and government officials in the region. The founder's visit to Abu Dhabi involved numerous meetings with government groups and strategic partners. These interactions were crucial in building a network of support for Aptera's entry into the UAE market. The choice of Abu Dhabi was strategic, given the city's progressive stance on adopting new technologies, particularly in the field of renewable energy and sustainable transportation. Steve Fambro highlighted the positive feedback they received, noting that the government and local partners were quite receptive to the innovative aspects of Aptera's technology. This acceptance is indicative of the UAE's commitment to integrating advanced technologies that align with their vision of a sustainable future. Steve Fambro's prior experience in the region, through his work with Fangro, played a significant role in facilitating these discussions. His existing relationships and understanding of the local business landscape proved invaluable in setting up meetings and fostering partnerships. This local expertise allowed Aptera to navigate the complexities of entering a new market with greater ease. During their visit, Chris and Steve participated in panels and discussions where they showcased Aptera's competitive advantages. One of the key points emphasized was how Aptera's technology could accelerate the adoption of EVs globally. By addressing common challenges associated with EVs, such as the need for extensive charging infrastructure, Aptera presents a compelling case for markets looking to transition to sustainable transportation. One of the significant hurdles for EV adoption is the development of a comprehensive charging infrastructure. Aptera's solar power technology offers a solution by reducing the dependency on traditional charging stations. This feature is particularly advantageous in regions where the establishment of such infrastructure is still in its nascent stages. The UAE, with its ample sunlight and commitment to renewable energy, is an ideal market for Aptera's solar EVs. Aptera's design focuses on maximizing energy efficiency. The vehicle's low drag coefficient means it requires less energy to move, allowing it to achieve higher ranges on a single charge. This efficiency is further enhanced by the vehicle's ability to harness solar power, making it an attractive option for eco-conscious consumers and governments looking to reduce their carbon footprint. The support from the UAE government was a significant highlight of Aptera's visit. The government's proactive approach in embracing new technologies, particularly in the transportation sector, aligns well with Aptera's vision. The UAE government's interest in sustainable and innovative transportation solutions is evident from their ongoing initiatives to integrate such technologies into their infrastructure. A crucial part of Aptera's visit was the ride and drive events held at the Yas Marina Circuit. These events allowed reservation holders, investors, and government officials to experience the vehicle firsthand. The feedback from these test drives was overwhelmingly positive, with many participants impressed by the vehicle's performance and the potential it holds for the future of transportation. The meetings and test drives culminated in a highly successful visit, paving the way for future collaborations. 
The UAE's commitment to supporting innovative transportation solutions was evident in their enthusiastic reception of Aptera. This success is expected to open doors for further investments and partnerships, facilitating Aptera's journey towards mass production and global distribution. Despite the positive reception, Aptera's journey is not without its challenges. The skepticism surrounding the feasibility and practicality of a solar-powered EV remains a hurdle. Many potential customers and investors are still cautious, waiting to see if Aptera can deliver on its promises. Aptera's founders are well aware of these concerns and are actively working to address them. The company's focus on transparency and continuous engagement with stakeholders is crucial in building trust and confidence. By showcasing the vehicle's capabilities and real-world performance, Aptera aims to dispel doubts and demonstrate the viability of their technology. Another significant challenge is ensuring a reliable supply chain for the production of Aptera vehicles. The company's efforts to secure partnerships and investments are aimed at mitigating these risks. The involvement of U.S. capital in consolidating investments is a positive step towards achieving this goal, ensuring that Aptera has the necessary resources to scale up production. The success of Aptera in the UAE has broader implications for the global EV market. By demonstrating the viability of solar-powered EVs in a region known for its progressive stance on renewable energy, Aptera sets a precedent for other markets. This success story can serve as a blueprint for introducing similar technologies in other parts of the world, accelerating the transition to sustainable transportation. Aptera's innovative approach to EVs positions it as a pioneer in the field of solar-powered transportation. The company's success in the UAE could inspire other manufacturers to explore similar technologies, leading to a more diverse and sustainable EV market. The adoption of Aptera's technology can significantly contribute to global environmental goals. By reducing the reliance on fossil fuels and minimizing the need for extensive charging infrastructure, Aptera supports efforts to reduce greenhouse gas emissions and promote renewable energy sources. Aptera's success in the UAE marks a significant milestone in the company's journey towards revolutionizing the EV market. The proactive efforts of Chris Anthony and Steve Fambro in building strategic partnerships, engaging with government officials, and showcasing the vehicle's competitive advantages have yielded positive outcomes. The enthusiastic reception from the UAE government and local partners underscores the potential of Aptera's technology to make a meaningful impact. As Aptera moves forward, the challenges of skepticism and supply chain reliability remain, but the company's commitment to transparency and innovation positions it well to overcome these hurdles. The success in the UAE not only paves the way for further investments and partnerships, but also sets a precedent for the global adoption of solar-powered EVs. In an industry constantly seeking advancements and sustainable solutions, Aptera's journey serves as an inspiring example of how innovative thinking and strategic engagement can drive significant progress. The road ahead may be challenging, but the foundation laid in the UAE provides a strong starting point for Aptera's vision of a sustainable future powered by the sun. And now let's hear from you in the comments section. If you enjoyed today's content, then give us a like, subscribe and ensure the bell notification is on to be notified of our recent content. Thanks for watching. See you in the next video.